Hey kids, good morning. It is time for a story and I want you to grab whatever stuffed animal or blankie or whatever else you might want to have with you. I have Bernie, my buddy. I have had him since I was two years old. As you can tell, he's a little worn out, but I still sleep with him every night. So if you want to have a buddy with you, go ahead. I'm going to put him right in my lap. And today we are going to read Amber's Sick Day. I thought this would be appropriate since it's autumn and the leaves and are beautiful and remember it takes place during the same season. So let me get to the first page. Here we go. All year long, little Amber Maple grew big and got strong. Her trunk got thicker. She got taller and her branches grew longer. You see she's measuring. Do your parents measure your height at home like that? Mine did that when I was little. But something is starting to feel different. Look at that. What's going on, huh? Something feels different. Her leaves feel tingly and she's tired. Tired. Amber Maple wonders if she's sick. Hmm. What do you think? Is she sick? She looks up at her mom and says, Mom, I don't feel good. You probably said that to your mom or dad a few times, right? Amber's mom gently pats Amber on the head and says, Don't worry, little one. Everything's okay. Amber trusts her mom, but she doesn't understand why she doesn't feel well. Why do you think she doesn't feel well? What do you think is going on? Noticing her leaves are turning colors and she's so tired. Oh, look how tired. Looks like Amber maybe needs a nap, huh? But her mom keeps telling her everything is okay. One day, Amber sees her leaves have turned completely orange and are dropping to the ground. What do you think is going on there? Mom, Amber cries, what's wrong with me? She's a little upset, huh? You're fine, little one. It's only fall. Amber has no idea what that means. She trusts her mom. What do you think it means? What do you think that means, that it's fall? As her leaves continue to fall, Amber gets really worried. You see that little fish down there? It's pretty cute, right? She's scared. She has no idea what's wrong with her. But she's worried she's really sick. What do you think? Is Amber sick? But she's so tired, she doesn't have the energy to ask her mom about it anymore. Maybe she just needs a nap, hmm? One day, her last leaf falls and Amber goes into feeling tired. She drops off to sleep. Good night, Amber. A little while later, Amber starts to wake up. How do you feel when you wake up in the morning? Kind of like that, huh? She's really cold, and there's funny white stuff all around her. But she feels better, too. Amber starts to quiver with excitement. She can sense other trees 
animals waking up too. <gasps> now that's exciting. Look at that. <gasps> Everybody's waking up. One day she notices that little green buds have formed on her branches. Do you see those little green buds on there? Maybe I wasn't really sick, Amber thinks. What do you think? Was she sick? As her green leaves peek out, Amber asks, Mom, is fall something that happens every year? Yes, little one, it's part of our natural cycle. Each year we get to shed our old clothes and put on new ones. Now that's kind of neat, right? Amber think that's pretty neat. It means she can become anyone she wants every year. Yay! And you know what? So can you. The end. Thanks for joining me for story time. I hope you and your favorite snuggly things had a great time, and I'll see you next month. Bye!